Hey everyone, today I'm gonna discuss e-bike battery fires from how they start to simple safety tips you can follow to avoid them. Before we dive in, be sure to like and subscribe to our channel so you get notified right away when we post a new video. So you've probably heard about the e-bike battery fires in New York and wondered how safe are lithium ion batteries. Electric bikes have been skyrocketing in popularity over the last few years and an unfortunate result of this boom is that a lot of cheap e-bikes with problematic parts have flooded the market. The number one cause of e-bike battery fires is poor quality, off-brand batteries, and chargers. Most premium electric bikes, including all juice bikes, have a battery management system or BMS that helps prevent the overcharging or over-discharging of the battery cells. However, cheaper e-bikes and off-brand replacement batteries do not have a BMS, making it all too easy to overcharge the battery cells and cause a dangerous fire. It's incredibly difficult to put out an e-bike battery fire because of a chemical chain reaction that occurs within the battery when the temperature reaches a certain point. So let's go over ways you can prevent e-bike battery fires from happening. The best thing you can do to ensure your safety is to never use an off-brand or aftermarket replacement battery or charger. I can't emphasize this enough. Buy your batteries and chargers directly from the same company you purchased your e-bike from and not from a third-party retailer. If you're unsure whether an e-bike battery is safe, ask the company's customer support if the battery conforms to UL standards. All juice bikes with a G2 battery have SGS certified to UL2271 battery packs that offer the industry's best safety rating for protection against e-bike battery fires. About 85% of e-bikes sold in the US have battery packs that have not been safety tested or certified to UL safety standards. If the e-bike battery you're looking at isn't conformed to UL2271, purchase it at your own risk. Our certified batteries also comply with recent New York City legislation mandating that all new e-bike battery packs are certified to UL2271. We're also in the final stages of receiving certification to UL2849 for the entire electronic system of our e-bikes, which will also comply with the New York City mandate. Another tip to avoid e-bike battery fires is to always follow the manufacturer's instructions when charging, storing, and maintaining your electric bike battery. The manufacturer knows the ins and outs of your battery and will always have the best recommendations for keeping it operating properly. When storing your e-bike battery, keep it in a clean, dry, and temperature controlled environment. Do not store your battery on or near water heaters or in direct sunlight. If you're having issues with your battery or it's been damaged, always contact the manufacturer directly. Take pictures or videos and include as much detailed information as possible when reaching out to the support team. Most manufacturers will replace a faulty battery if you follow the warranty process. However, most companies will void your warranty if you tamper with your battery before reaching out to them. And a last word of advice for keeping e-bike battery fires at bay is to never open your battery. Let the battery experts at your e-bike company handle all the heavy lifting of servicing your battery. So now you know everything about e-bike battery fires to stay safe out there. Remember, purchasing a UL conforming battery for your e-bike and following the manufacturer's instructions for charging, storing, and maintaining your battery is one of the most effective ways to ensure battery fires won't happen to you. And never buy off-brand or aftermarket replacement batteries or chargers. Thanks for watching and comment below if you have any questions about e-bike battery fire safety.